Hi, I'm Mark Carrier, CEO of Marketing Tactics, creator of Your Lead Engine, and author of the Golden Leads Formula Blueprint. Hello and welcome to my five-part video series on how to generate consumer leads that close at over 20% using the Golden Leads Formula. If you're like most people working in a sales-driven industry, the most frustrating aspect of your business is getting high-quality leads that convert. After all, you know what to do with a good lead when you get one, right? The problem with most lead strategies today that are based on white papers, special reports, Google AdWords, or Facebook pay-per-click campaigns is that you don't know anything about the person except their contact details and perhaps some fairly generic demographics. This means you can't talk to their specific needs and problems, and as a result, your engagement and close rates are average at best. You find the same thing using cold call lists where you'd be lucky to get better than a 2 to 3% conversion rate. And in the last few years, people have been buying leads from suppliers who promote online contests offering a variety of different prizes like iPhones or tablets or $500 shopping carts. Yeah, you know how it works. After a person enters their name and contact details, they have to answer a range of survey style questions from up to 25 different companies. And of course, all these companies get the same leads as you do at the same time. So if you don't call your leads quickly enough, every other company has already called them and your leads get so sick of all the calls that it can be pretty tough to get them to take your call. The other problem people seem to be having is that they're only able to get in touch with about half their leads. And if you're paying anywhere from a dollar to ten dollars a lead and only getting in touch with half your leads, you have to ask yourself, what are the leads really costing you? And to top it all off, rarely do you hear anybody getting close rates of more than one to five percent. Now if you're here with me today, I'm guessing that you're still looking for a better way to generate really good leads. So you can finally say goodbye to the stress and frustration of using low performing leads. And if that's true, then you've come to the right place and I have some really good news for you. The most surprising thing about generating a wealth of high converting leads is that it doesn't need to be a stressful or disappointing experience. The key to getting the leads you need to crush your sales targets is gathering the right consumer intelligence because this added knowledge consistently translates into high conversion rates. And what consumer intelligence are we talking about? Which products or services your prospects are interested in right now and when they want to buy them? Over the past 34 years, I've generated hundreds of thousands of leads. And this started out out of necessity back in the late 80s when I owned a 24 seat call center with a partner of mine. Back then, our clients were mainly timeshare developers and financial planners who wanted us to deliver hundreds of sales appointments every week. And we were paid for each prospect we delivered that fit our cl client's qualifications and attended a sales presentation. And if the prospect wasn't qualified and attended a sales presentation, we didn't get paid. And let me tell you, working under those conditions, you quickly learned how to find the right prospects and cost effectively engage with them, or you went broke in a heartbeat. The internet hadn't really got started in those days, so we bought lists from list brokers and sent out tons of direct mail to drive inbound calls. And sometimes we had good results, but most of the time it was really, really tough. Then we started using contests as a lead gen tactic and started generating huge numbers of great leads every week. It was a pretty simple program where we ran free entry contests with prizes that had wide appeal and a high perceived value. We purchased entry boxes and printed entry forms to collect people's names, contact details, included survey questions to qualify them and place these entry boxes in high traffic locations like convenience stores. Each week, we collect the entry slips and sort through them to find the leads that were qualified to our clients' needs and pass these on to our team to contact. Before we knew it, we had 300 entry boxes delivering up to 10 qualified leads per box each week. And these leads were so hot, our conversion rate jumped by up over 600%, which dramatically increased our productivity and significantly reduced our costs. These days, you don't see many entry boxes out there. However, you do see contests promoted all over the internet, and for good reason. Contests are a great way to generate a wealth of high closing leads, provided you know what you're doing. 
The lead generation formula you're about to discover uses online contests because they consistently generate above average acquisition rates and the consumer intelligence needed to achieve higher close rates. Clients of ours consistently achieve close rates of more than five times higher than their other lead sources by following this exact same formula. To show you an example of what I'm talking about, let's have a look at one of our charity clients who were using a co-registration leads and see the impact generating their own contest leads has had for them. Just to give you a little background, our client was testing co-registration leads for a few months. Then they decided to go back to driving Facebook pay-per-click traffic to their own online contest because they were getting much better results that way. And you can really tell when you see the huge difference of over 525% in the close rates of their own contest leads compared to the co-registration leads that they were buying. And the reasons for the huge increase in the close rate is really due to a few factors. Firstly, by driving traffic to their own contest, they were in control of the targeting of the audience that they wanted to connect with. And secondly, by simply asking a few of the right survey questions, they were able to obtain the consumer intelligence they needed to zero in on those leads that were buyer ready. And lastly, when they called these leads, the leads knew who they were and were open to taking their call. Now, you've probably noticed that the lead cost for the contest leads is double that of what my client paid for their co-registration leads. And I should point out that the lead cost is an annualized cost for this comparison and covers all the costs involved, prizes, contest site, and the pay-per-click ads. Of course, you might ask, why would anyone pay twice as much for a lead from one source over another? And the answer is, you wouldn't unless you got at least twice the value in return. And as you can see by the bottom line results, it really doesn't matter what your cost per lead is. The most important metric is your overall cost per sale. And as we go through this example, you can see what the effect having higher close rates has on your costs. In this case, the biggest cost savings is in the telemarketing costs. Because when you're using higher closing leads, it takes less time to generate a sale. And as you see here, regardless of the lead source, the telemarketers typically make five presentations each hour. And in the case of the co-registration leads, the average close was 3.67%, which meant that they averaged 0.18 sales per operator hour. So on that close rate, it took them around five and a half hours to make a sale. And when you calculate the telemarketing cost at $35 an hour, the total telemarketing cost for a sale comes to $190. Now, when you look at the performance of their contest leads, you see that they're achieving at just over one sale in operator hour, which brings their telemarketing costs way down and saves them close to $155 on every sale. And when you look at the bottom line with the overall cost of sale comparison, you see they're saving $188 a sale with their own contest leads, which goes straight to the bottom line. Pretty interesting comparison, isn't it? Just imagine how much easier your life could be if you had the new leads that close just like these. In the next four videos you'll be receiving, we'll cover two lead generation myths, developing your contest strategy, the importance of cost of sale and customer lifetime value, identifying your ideal customer, and the five pillars of generating contests that act as lead magnets that convert. You'll be receiving the next video in your inbox in the next few days. So be sure to add our email address to your safe sender list so you can keep an eye out for it. You're gonna love it. It's called Sacred Cows Make the Best Hamburger. So thanks for your time and I'm looking forward to speaking with you soon. Bye for now.